we're at Avon Tyrrell. That means it must be Enduro Man Week. Don't adjust your sets. This is Run For Adventure. Welcome back to the channel. I'm not swimming. I just thought that'd make a really good intro. We are all registered. We've got our Enduroman bags of goodies. Uh, we've got our timing chips, we've got our numbers. So we're gonna head on down back to the van, get kitted up. We're gonna watch uh, Steve start the 50, and then myself and Liga are gonna start Run To Your Max 24 hours back at Enduroman. Love it. It's 10 past one. Uh, we all start at two o'clock. I'm running Run To Your Max 24 hour, so is Liga. Steve is running the 50 miler. We've got 50 minutes, we better get changed. Well, that was easy. Let's go running. We are making our way to the start line of uh, run to your max 24 hours. And the reason we've come up, do a bit of training, try and highlight this awesome event to everybody out there. I'm a massive fan, as you can tell by the t-shirt, it was where I did my first ultra many years ago. I came and did Enduro Man 100. The 100 miler didn't really go to plan. I had a great 50, second 50 was a disaster, but I made it to the finish. And what did happen is I fell in love with this event and I've been coming back ever since. So Enduro Man is a weekend of a festival of ultra distance events. So they have swimming events, triathlons and also running events. All the running events are done around a 1.04 mile loop and the loop runs around this stunning house, Avon Tyrrell. Beautiful place, amazing. So it's a really varied loop, some really technical bits, so you have to be focused, some descents, and there's about 100 foot of gain each time you go around. So we've come to do a bit of training. I've come to trial a few shoes that I've got. It's a perfect place for that. Um, so no mega mileage, a bit of training mileage, and obviously shooting a film of a 24 hour, but we're also making a film about the Enduro Man event. We just popped up to the start of the 50 and the 100 mile to see Steve off. So Steve's running the 50 like we said before. So we're gonna see him off and we've got to go down to the turning circle and we're gonna be starting just after two o'clock. <laughs> We're off. So that is the start for Enduro Man. Run to your max 24 hours. 24 hours of fun on this beautiful 1.04 mile loop. So as we go round the loop, we're gonna give you a little guided tour of the tricky sections, the beautiful sections, the sections that really start to grind you down towards the end. So come along for the ride. So this is the beautiful woodland section. Unfortunately, it also comes with the roots of doom. Lots and lots of tree roots that when you're fresh, not a problem. When you're tired in the middle of the night, definitely a big problem. I was talking about the roots of doom. When I did the 100, this root here, that little cheeky bugger, I tripped on that route at about 50 miles in. Managed to save the fall, but damaged the ligaments in my ankle. It was then 48 miles of pain and suffering. So these routes can definitely catch you out. 
is the tunnel of love. And if you're over six foot tall, watch out for them low hanging trees, especially at night or if you've got a cap on. So you've seen a beautiful woodland. Now we are coming past the gorgeous boating lake section. How stunning is that? It might be a loop race, but it's definitely a beautiful loop. So this section seems pretty flat. It's a bit of a false hill. So early on, you're running up this. It's great, you're loving life. But there's a slight incline. And this really grinds you down the further you go. Beautiful, but it grinds you down. So we call this section the tedious tennis court. This hill, a lot of guys come here and they run it like I am now. Big mistake, if you're doing long distance at Enduro Man, walk this hill, it'll save your legs and you might make it to the finish. Just before you get to the turning circle, we've got another hill. And yep, you've guessed it, there is more routes, more routes to trip over on. So you make it to the top of the hill, quick turn to the right, now downhill through this nice shaded area, so if it's hot, lovely bit of running this, all the way down into the circle of energy. So this is the turning point, without doubt, the best point of the whole loop. You come into the turning circle, loads of support, loads of encouragement, really gives you a lift, gives you lots of energy. We're out of the turning circle, back up the hill. One loop done. Hope you enjoyed the Enduro Man journey. Just gives you a brief insight. Ah, TC. Well a brief insight into how amazing this loop is. If loop races have always put you off, this isn't your standard flat loop. It's got a bit of everything, which keeps it really interesting. Yeah. Is adore you all of the time. I like to I like to I like to love you every day. I like to love you, love you. So definitely not gonna beast myself over the 24 hours. We've got the classic quarter in a few weeks. So I thought this was a perfect opportunity to come and get maybe some back-to-back -back runs. You know, push some distance over the 24 miles, but by the end of it, I want to be feeling fresh. Don't want to be injured. Definitely don't want to be knackered. Okay, sad face. We had glorious sunshine when we started. Now, it's absolutely chucking it down. Keeps you cool though, I suppose. So this lady, one loop to go to 50 miles. This is Susie, by the way. When we turned up and said hello to Susie, she just flippantly threw in that she had biked to Enduro Man to do, is it 48 hours to your end? So just casually, yeah, I biked to the event. And we were like, oh, okay, cool. But it was 260 miles. Yeah, 260 miles. This is the kind of people you meet at Enduro Man. Crazy people, crazy people. Well done, Susie. Keep on trucking. When it's lashing down with rain like this Enduro Man, it becomes even more challenging. Lots of wet routes. You've got some dodgy wet bridges to cross. So you have to be super careful. It makes a challenging route. A damn sight more challenging when it's wet. So that is the first session done. Done 21 miles. We are going to get some dinner. So that's another bonus about being an Enduro Man. Avon Tyrrell, all hot food. So we're gonna go and grab some dinner. 
have a little bit of a stretch, a little bit of a cool off, and refuel for the next session. I'd like to love you night and day if I may, may, may. Stop, have some dinner. Don't tell anyone, but we watched Eurovision as well. Good old UK finishing bottom. But yeah, we're back out on course. We can get some laps in, get some mileage done, and then get tucked up for a bit of sleep back out in the morning. They say romance is dead. I know how to show a woman a good time. Running in the woods at night around a muddy, wet, technical trail route. Good stuff. So that is a wrap on tonight's proceedings. It is two o'clock in the morning. We're gonna stop for now. We're gonna go and get back in the van and have a bit of sleep. And we'll be back out in the morning to crack out a few more laps around the Enduro Man course. That is us done for the night. We'll see you bright and early in the morning. <laughs> oh, that was better. Good night's sleep. Let's go and get some breakfast. So we are back out on the run route. Third session, probably gonna try and do another half marathon. Another good bit of training mileage in the legs. You know, you can run, you can come out, you can run, you can push hard and really work hard on distance. Or you can just come out, run when you want, get some good training miles, no pressure. Hello, mate. That's another awesome thing about Enduro Man. When you get to your final lap, you reverse and you run it back the other way. So that lad was just finishing the half Ironman. So you get high fives all the way around. This is the winner of the triple continuous Ironman. Get in. Well done, fella. Awesome. <laughs> this is Graham. Uh, if you ever oh, come yeah. to uh, Enduro Man, he will definitely be here. Yep. He is the happiest man you will ever meet oh. on a run route. We will now have a short intermission. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the Graham Kelly Show! Always like to run the hills, <laughs> always run the hills. Ultra fuel, ultra noodle. <laughs> Caretaker of the course. Caretaker of the course. Caretaker of the course. Hello. Look who I've just bumped into. Had to meet you here. We are on our last lap, so five minutes to two. We started at two o'clock, 24 hours ago. So this is the last loop. Managed to get a few miles in. So done another half marathon today, or just over. So we've got 40 miles in. 40 good, tough training miles in in the 24 hours. So. Nothing serious, haven't pushed too hard. Put some good training miles in the legs. On to the finish. We're done. We've just crossed the line. We've got a nice shiny medal, our Enduro Man medal. Really good, really enjoyed the event. Really enjoyed running around the loop again. I love this loop. Super challenging, but you get to see everybody going around. Lots of encouragement, lots of support. Wicked place to come and do an event. Loaded up, let's hit the road back to Cornwall. It's always quite a sad morning, Monday morning, and leaving the Enduro Man family behind, but you know, as we say, there's always next year.
So that is the end of another awesome weekend at Avon Tyrrell and at Enduro Man. I really hope you like the video guys. We've tried to capture the awesome atmosphere that we get at Enduro Man. If you are interested in the event, if you have liked what you've seen, there will be a link in the description. Definitely go and check it out. It's definitely worth coming down to Avon Tyrrell and taking part in this awesome event. If you like the video guys, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, any comments you've got guys, leave them in the comment section below. If you've got any questions about the event or you wanna come down and you wanna find out more about it, feel free to ask and we'll try and get back to you and answer your questions. We shot this film, but we've also captured a lot of footage of the event, so there will be another film coming out soon, hopefully, once we've edited and looked at all the hundreds and hundreds of hours of footage that we got, there is gonna be another film. So watch this space, it will be coming soon soon and as always on run for adventure stay safe and keep on running